What's going on? Welcome back to another video. Today we have a budget airsoft review and today's airsoft gun only costs $25. That's it. It is the AGM M50 shotgun. With the reviews I was getting and for the price, I knew I had to try this. It only cost me $25 on eVike. So uh, let's dive in, right? This is the box you get. Now, was I expecting anything glamorous in the packaging? Maybe a sticker at least, but I gotta keep in mind that it cost only $25 for this. Let's dive in. This apparently comes with a version that has a stock. Here is your manual. Just a quick overview of the gun itself, and that's it. And it just says airsoft gun on here. Now I already took the plastic wrapper off to make this a little more presentable and just to see if I actually got what I ordered. But right here you have, right here you have your speed loader. You do get a jamming rod as well. You have some BBs, we can chuck that. Then you have your magazine. I'm not actually sure how many rounds this holds. I believe 25. I actually bought a second magazine for about $7 because I plan on using this in the field. It just looks fun, shotgun. Then you have the shotgun itself. Now, right away, this thing's got some weight to it. I was actually very surprised. $25, and you have a heavy shotgun. There's not gonna be too much to go over. Start from the back and make our way up. You have your plastic grip, but with the indents that they've made, I like the grip. It feels good in the hand. You have your plastic trigger. Right next to the trigger is your safety, which is kinda hard to get in there with. But you gotta push that up, then the trigger will no longer work. It's not an easy safety to really just take in and out, but this does absolutely nothing. But as we make our way up the gun, you have your hop up adjustment, which like I said, and I'm gonna be saying this a lot, for a $25 shotgun, the fact that you even have that option, pretty good. And it's straightforward, easy to use. This is where the magazine goes in. Make sure it's facing the right way. Push in a little bit, click to release. Simply press the button. Oh my to release. Press the button, exchange. The only trouble is making sure you find it in the right spot. Good to go. And then we have the pump. Now the pump, pump's kind of fun. I mean, that is the fun part of a shotgun, right? That's a pretty good sound. I do like the detailing they have on the barrel. Makes it feel a little more realistic. Just adds a little more style to the gun. Now the pump action, smooth. If you don't bring it all the way, it's not gonna stick there. It's gonna spring right back. It's cocked, bring it forward. It will not fire if it's in this position. There's not much to it. I mean, it is the shotgun. But now, will I be pleased with how it performs? I say I like it. I really, really like it. Now, obviously need to test this on the field before I can really give you full honest review, but just from firing it up here in the attic, it's a lot of fun. For $25, I don't know how, I don't know how you could say anything bad on this. I think this is a bang for your buck. If you're thinking about shotgun, but you don't want to invest too much money on it, Try this out, see if shotguns are for you. And with that being said, I'm gonna end the video here. If you enjoyed this video, hit that like button, it helps a lot. If you haven't already subscribed, subscribe. 99% of my viewers are not subscribed, so it would help a lot. I am really trying to invest a lot into this channel this year. I'll be putting gameplay out, so please keep coming back and checking on that. But probably more towards the spring. If there's any other kind of videos you wanna see me do on this channel, let me know. If you wanna keep seeing budget reviews, comment below what you wanna see next, because this is a lot of fun, $25. I mean, come on, this costs. I will see you in the next video. Keep it crispy.